Well, it's early Saturday morning. Everybody's here setting up. Stand by for more. There's all my stuff in a pile. <laughs> God, I had a truck full. Well, I'm finished. All set up. All I gotta do is go back to the truck, get my cushion and a clamp. I forgot that. Everybody's setting up. It's a beautiful day. I think this thing opens at 10, 10 to 4. And it is 9.09 now. Daddy, can you do that? Stand by. Well, I sound like I'm in Virginia Beach. The jets are out. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. First customer. It's a buck, I think. Let me see. Oh, no. They're not even close. Smith and Wesson. Black Ops. Damn. But I got action anyway. three just rolled in. Striker fighter. Strike fighter. I don't know what kind of knife it is. I, anyway, we got to go to work again. And where do you live? You live in Virginia Beach? Yep. Well, number five, Southern States pocket knife. I don't know if you'll remember it or not. Those of you who've been following me a while, but I did this knife two years ago. And I got, a lady just came by and says, oh, are you still here on Thursdays? I said, no, but I might be. Well, how long are you going to be here? I said to a fool, I'm going home. Get my knives. I'll be back in a minute. I don't know how many she's got, but the kitchen knives. So I'm going to be a little busy anyway. That's a help. Stand by. Pick it up. I sharpened a knife for that, that booker I sharpened a minute ago. I didn't realize I was for one of the kids working way over there you can't see them as a christmas tree vendor and they use these knives to work on the christmas trees so i did one for one guy and he said oh i gotta get my knife sharpened he brought his over here it's a big old buck okay action number six i think smith and wesson extreme ops look at this the best of it homemade turkey sandwich. I should say half of a homemade turkey sandwich. The glass lady gave it to me. Lady sells all that glass right there. She actually makes it, blows it herself. I like it. I like the sandwich. Boy, that baby's ready. Turkey and mayonnaise. Eight and nine. I got a Gerber Bear and a Remington three-bladed pocket knife. Damn. Number 10, I think. No, 11. One dozen as a crow flies. Kershaw. This is my first encounter with one of these uh, Rick Hender designed Kershaws. It's a, it's a really nice knife. I don't know what it costs. It's a Rick Hender 155 5TI. But what I like about it is, and I've seen some of these on other knives, but it's a frame lock. 
You remember that little mountain climb I, knife I got? It's like that, the frame, flame, the frame, like a spring-loaded flame, frame, I mean, it, it locks it in place right there. Those uh, knives made by, uh, hell, what's his name? The big knife maker in Idaho. I can't think of his name now. He's a, he kind of invented this frame lock thing. But that's a cool, that's a cool, I like that frame lock. See it? You push it out like that to get it nice back in. Cool little knife. Ashen, one of my returning customers from this morning, sent his wife back. You remember that little bench made knife? Well, this same guy. He got a Gerber, a steel hatchet, some nice Jenga, Jenga scissors, and a big serrated international heckle. And it's 3.30. I got to get to work. Bye.